I was talking about making a videos like a sunscreen videos under rupees 300 haul and yeah here's the video finally and today is also my birthday and yep it's Valentine's Day and guess what I am so single that I'm even posting videos on Valentine's Day and it's also Shoroshuti Puja and my type is a boy <laughs> so here's my long waited video about sunscreens and this haul is just for my teenage girlies who have money issues but they still want like SPF protection. I have a couple of options. You know the summer of Kolkata, right? It's sweaty, it's humid and no matter what, like whatever you apply, you're gonna sweat like hell. I will talk about each and every sunscreen and like the application, the sunscreen filters and I will also talk about like the skin type that can use this or not. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, also, it is a pre-recorded video, so I'm shooting this video on 13th February and I will post this video on 14th February. I'm saying this, it's my birthday, but yeah, my birthday is technically tomorrow. But you are watching this video on 14th February, so technically it is my birthday today, so yeah. Also, I don't like cakes. <laughs> so, my first sunscreen is this Foxtail Daily Glow Sunscreen SPF 50 PA++++, Nacinamide plus Vitamin C, all skin types and... I am so impressed with the sunscreen filters of this sunscreen. Initially, I had no idea that Foxtel has a sunscreen. You guys told me to try this one out. And here is my review. And also, I always save the box for the review purposes. And I love the heart that it has. So before talking about the texture of the sunscreen, how it actually is, let me tell you, like let me quickly tell you the sunscreen filters of the sunscreen. Also, my name player is done for. Do you guys know anything that like the customizable nameplate lighting something like this uh, that, ca that, that can be done online and I can order online because yeah I, I deliberately need a nameplate of my own. If you guys know any website like this then please help me in the comment section and now let's talk about the sunscreen filters of the sunscreen okay I might get tongue twisted so yeah bear with me. So the first sunscreen that it has diethyl amino hydroxy benzoyl hexyl benzoid. You know what? It's Uvinal A+. That is a new generation of sunscreen filters and I don't know why they named the like IUPAC name. Like, they literally could have used the common name of it but, but they decided to use the IUPAC name and they're like, we have input some crazy shit in this and you're like, you're, you're gonna, you guys are gonna be like, oh my, what the heck is it? Don't worry, it's like Uvinal A+. It's a new generation of UV filters. It is a chemical sunscreen filter that protects your skin against UVA sun rays. Then the second sunscreen filter is Ethyl Hexy Triazone. That is Uvinal T150. It is again a new generation of sunscreen filters. And it's a chemical sunscreen filter that protects your skin against UVB rays. The last sunscreen filter is Trace Biphenyl Triazine. That is Tinosorf A2B. It's again a new generation of sunscreen filter that protects your skin against both UVA and UVB rays. It also has Niacinamide and Vitamin C and Tocopherol. That is Vitamin E. And it also has fragrance. It also has silicone for the texture to, to get the texture better. Now let me tell you how it actually is. So it has fragrance, okay? The mild fragrance. I like the fragrance is so known to me, but I don't know like where did I sniff it? I don't know. Maybe it's fair and lovely smell. I don't know. My mom used to use fair and lovely. Yeah, maybe it has like the chemically sort of smell. Let me give you how it is. So this is how it is. So it definitely has kind of thick texture and it takes kind of like 15 to 20 seconds of blend. Once it gets blended out properly, there's zero white cast and it gives beautiful, beautiful, beautiful shine. There are some people who have issues with old generation of sunscreen filters like Evobenzone, Oxybenzone, Octicrylene. They cannot handle that type of uh, sunscreen filters. Okay, for you, you can go for this because it has like the, the new uh, generation of sunscreen filters. I, I generally use two finger roll with this sunscreen and basically add yeah, this must. In the beginning, it gets like this. But don't worry, it gets absorbed by the skin so nicely. So here's the real time blending that I'm showing you. See? Just how quick and easy it was. And it gives the beautiful, beautiful, beautiful glow to your face. It's so affordable. I think it was for rupees. Uh, 243 or 250 something 256 uh, when I got it from Amazon and oh, 
Now, who can use this? See, I have uh, extremely sweaty skin and I have combination like oily combination skin and as summer in West Bengal is like crazy and it's so humid that that no matter what your skin type is, you're, you're, you're still gonna sweat. So I think for the extreme summer months like the May, June and, and like the, the ending of April, I think this sunscreen might be heavy for extremely oily skin people but if you have dry to normal to like combination skin and basically if you live uh, to the higher side of the West Bengal, let's say on Darjeeling, Shiliguri, like if like that part of the region or like if you're from Kashmir or like the higher altitudes where there's like uh, less humidity then this sunscreen is gonna be perfect for you even in like uh, crazy summer daytime and this sunscreen is perfect 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 for uh, winter season and as it is like the ending of winter yeah this is a great pick as we use sunscreen anyways so i think if you ha if you are a teenager if you are a school going girl you can you can like anytime anytime get this because yeah even if you do not uh, apply the sunscreen in the crazy winter daytime when you go to school you can still use it in the in the in the room like when you are in indoors you can still use the sunscreen because it is budget friendly and it has like new generation of filters and basically it has all chemical filters now but i still like the glow that it gives me yeah the second pick is this underrated sunscreen okay this sunscreen is going viral i think all over the internet because it is yeah it is underrated and it is also affordable and i think the packaging and everything reminds me uh, like the minimal of the minimalist sunscreen is it summer approved let's find out so let's talk about the sunscreen sunscreen filters that it has sunscreen filters that it has so it has total three sunscreen filters and all the sunscreen filters are real basic so first filter is ethyl hexy methoxycyanamide i don't know why they pick the, the the hard name all the times it literally means octyl methoxycyanamide that is a uvb filter like yeah they could have like easily used that the like the, the easy name or the octinoset name that like the easy name but they picked the hard one i don't know I, maybe they wanna give us hard times <laughs> the second sunscreen filter is butyl methoxydibenzomethane that is avobenzone and some people have issues with avobenzone but it has avobenzone avobenzone is a chemical sunscreen agent that uh, protects your skin against uv ARS. there's a bird yeah then the third sunscreen filter is benzophenone 3 that is oxybenzone it is a chemical sunscreen filter that protects your skin against both uva and uvb rays and it has fragrance some other ingredients are it has rosemary uh, leaf extract then vitamin e and vitamin c and phospholipids so let me show you the texture of this sunscreen so it has thick consistency and it takes around uh, 10 to 15 seconds of blending and the smell is like uh, really semi similar and um, i don't know like the, it is very known to me so it takes kind of more time than the foxtail sunscreen to blend properly to blend out properly yeah now it's it has been blended properly and it has shine already let me tell you how it is on my skin tone on my skin type my skin type yeah so this is two fingers and yeah it has kind of runny texture also real time blending yeah and again this uh, video is non sponsored cuz yeah <laughs> it is a non sponsored video it gives satin finish to the skin not too dewy uh, not too matte but somewhere between the dewiness and like the extreme matte uh, uh, like matte effect i don't know how this sunscreen is gonna be in the summer times i have like this uh, sensation that it might gonna make my skin you know sweaty in the summer in the summer season i think like the, I, I don't know I, i'm just guessing it might make my skin you know uh, sweaty in the summer season i don't know but for now like for, for for like current uses it is it is a great pick again i love the fact that it doesn't even feel under my makeup someone wanted to know uh, did i use the sunscreen outside or not or do i only use the sunscreen in the inside yes i used it on in the outside like when i go for like a uh, 
slight shopping i can't approve that in terms of shopping because i went to a mall and basically i, I was like out in the sunlight maybe for uh, 10 to 50 like no not 10 like for five minutes yeah for maximum five minutes then i went to the mall and uh, when i was like uh, coming out of the mall again i reapplied my sunscreen with a dot and key sunstick so yeah i don't know how it is outside yet though i didn't get tanned i think in that way i can say it is a safe sunscreen to use outside and it has like the old generation filters the the filters that we've been using for years in that way it is a safe formulation and you can use it outside i'm suggesting all the budget sunscreens with you guys uh, yeah, for like the affordable sunscreen like under 300 sunscreen with you guys so i like if you want to know like how it is on outside then i need to use it on summertime when the sun is gonna be at, it, at its peak and yeah I, then i need to find out how it is but as i'm making this video in the late winter time so yeah uh, i need like a couple of months more to review this thing but yeah you can definitely go for the foxtel sunscreen because it has all, like all like the new generation filters and you guys are crazy for i think you guys are crazy for new generation filters i don't know you can go go with this one anytime so now let's talk about the most favorite sunscreen that i have that, like that i have in this the, in this sunscreen category this is my my, my extreme favorite and someone uh, like someone asked me so many times to review this sunscreen and that's why i i got this and thank you for telling me this because I, I freaking love this so this is the flix guava glow sunscreen this is how it looks it, it has like all the 50 gram of quantity and it has no silicone no paraben no mineral oil no fragrance no fragrance like this is the first sunscreen in my affordable sunscreen haul that is fragrance free let me quickly tell you the sunscreen filters of this sunscreen so it has ethoxyl methoxycyanamide benzophenone 3 butyl methoxydibenzomethane and zinc oxide so it has all the sunscreen filters that the zinc uh, that, the, that the underrated sunscreen has uh, the new addition is zinc oxide and it has some amazing ingredients also these are phytospignosin vitamin e tocopherol acetate uh, vitamin c and uh, ceramide np ceramide ap ceramide eop cholesterol and some phospholipids and also sodium hyaluronate this sunscreen was not under uh, 300 but when i grabbed it from amazon it was for rupees 301 let's say it was for rupees 300 and that's why i am talking about the sunscreen because most of the times you're gonna get the sunscreen on 300 rupees or maximum times under 300 rupees or 310 rupees see i am willing to pay 10 rupees more for this formulation because it has ceramides lipids cholesterols like phytospignosin like all the amazing things that my skin barrier has and my skin barrier is gonna love also sodium hyaluronate yeah and the fact that it's fragrance free but it has colorant that is 42090 let me show you how it is the pump doesn't work properly that's the bummer see like i need to struggle a lot to get the product out of it and i also tried this technique like uh, i i got a safety pin and i uh, like uh, put the safety pin here and i pushed it someone said me that uh, try this technique and this pump packaging works but it, it still didn't work properly i tried this technique but still no improvement i think there's there's something wrong with this uh, batch number and like this packaging uh, yeah this packaging so here how it is it is extremely 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 lightweight and let me show it to you on my face again gonna go with two finger roll but yeah i need to struggle uh, to get the product out honestly every time i'm so tired at this point I need to open this to show you how it is because the pump was not working at all yeah so you see it's pink in color oh I'm, I'm so heartbroken right now and I'm I'm so disappointed that I need to do this and I'm kind of angry too yeah so I didn't want to tip my finger in in it so I, I got myself the spatula So this is how it is. Let's apply it on the face, okay? And show you, show it to you. I think I I got a bit too much sunscreen. <laughs> I I definitely took a lot because my 
I can feel it on my skin that I took a lot. I think because of the ceramides, it's extremely soothing on the skin. And I'm sure that this sunscreen is not gonna make my skin uh, like sweaty or anything in the sun, in the in the crazy summer season. You know, one thing to mention that applying so much sunscreen is also not good for your skin. If you apply too much sunscreen, it might clog your pores. And then my fourth option is I cannot find that sunscreen. Okay, that was like the deconstruct sunscreen. It was for rupees three uh, two ninety two ninety six. The deconstruct sunscreen and I cannot find it right now. I don't know why did I put it. I made a dedicated review on the deconstruct sunscreen. I think last year. I'll put the link in the description box and also on the i button. I cannot find the sunscreen right now. But there's a, there's a thing that this sunscreen is appropriate. The deconstruct sunscreen is. Uh, only appropriate for extremely dry skin people because i tried that sunscreen and in extreme uh, summer season it made my skin sweaty sweaty a lot but i like the whipped consistency that it had and it it made my skin like um, how could i say it like as it has silicone so it makes the skin surface so smooth because of the silicone that it has as it has silicone it made skin super blurry but it did not work for me as my skin sweats a lot when i applied the sunscreen on my face my skin started to sweat uh, that's why if your skin sweats too much uh, don't use it but if you have dry to normal skin then definitely go for the deconstruct sunscreen and my final recommendations are okay these are not under uh, 300 rupees but it will be in 300 rupees in most of the times so you know ecological sunscreens yeah i love their like the glow version obviously the 50 ml version of it it is their 80 gram version uh, i also like the detail sunscreen but somehow it it makes my skin dull kind of dull whereas this one does not and i i use the sunscreen most of the times indoors i also sometimes use the sunscreen on the outdoors uh, ecologica runs buy one get one sale most of the time like uh, Three to four times a year they run the sale. And you can get the 50 gram version of this sunscreen uh, for buy one get one sale. So one will cost you under uh, 300 rupees. Yeah. So definitely get the this Ecologica sunscreens on sale from Ecologica uh, during sale. Yeah, during buy one get one sale. So if you wanna know my favorite sunscreens. These are like the Foxtel sunscreen and this Splix Guava sunscreen. Uh, if you have uh, like money issues, yeah, like if you think that uh, the, you cannot afford the Plix sunscreen, then definitely go for the Foxtel sunscreen. You're definitely gonna enjoy it a lot. Sunscreens that I love, my sister sometimes hates them, and the sunscreen that my sister loves, uh, sometimes I do not like that that sunscreen yeah so choosing a sunscreen for you is a difficult thing so try and apply like buy so many sunscreens and see for yourself that what is working for you and if you find a sunscreen that is working for you in like most of the seasons of the year it is your soulmate it is your prince charming don't let it go and keep repurchasing the sunscreen again and again and yeah that's it don't forget to wish me happy birthday in my comment section okay yeah <laughs> and i'll see you guys in the next video till then take care and bye and mwah.